Hello everybody, Nitz the Gamer here, and welcome back to another part of The Walking Dead Season 2, Episode 5. So this is the second part, so, um, we successfully fought off those, um, Russian guys. Um, I spared Arvo's life, and, um, yeah, fixed, uh, Kenny's bandages, Luke is shot in the leg, Mike is shot in the arm, Jane came back. Thank you so much, Jane, I love you. Alright. A lot of silence. Is that it? Until he spoke. Hey, I'm talking to you! What? It? It's what? What do you mean, what? The place you're fucking taking us. He doesn't speak much English. Yeah, no shit. Is that it? I thought you said it was a house. Arvo, that's not what you're taking us to, right? How much further is the house you were talking about? Answer her, goddammit! It's still more walk. Some more hours. God damn it! I knew this was gonna happen. This guy fucked us. Uh, thank you. Don't oh. mention it. It's getting dark. Maybe we should stop for the night. This is bullshit. Relax. Don't tell me to relax. He's lying. He's been lying this whole time. You don't fucking know that. I know we've been walking all day and we're still fucking I'm nowhere. I'm defending Luke here. Luke needs a break. We probably all do. Look, I'll do whatever you guys want. Okay, but. I could use the rest. It'd be safer to rest in there, where there's a fence. Can we just try and have a calm, quiet night? Please. That sounds nice. Yes, please. Yeah. That'd be nice. Yeah, it does. Very nice. Oh, shit. Sorry about that. It's all right, buddy. It's all right. If we're staying, we should scout this place out. All right. Y'all wait here. I'll go make sure this ain't some walker nest we're locking ourselves into. I'll go with you. Uh, see if, uh, see if you can calm him down a bit. Okay. Uh, yeah. Yeah, Jane and Kenny? Alright. No, awesome. That's all you. <laughs> Wouldn't guess that awesome. Work. Me neither. I think he likes you. Oh, uh, Calmed right down for you. He's cute. Yeah, <laughs> he is, isn't he? Most babies are pretty ugly this soon after being born. That's true. They usually look like weird little aliens. Oh, come Here, on. I got He's him. just a little boy. He's cute. Come on over. It's safe. <clears throat> Okie dokie. Hopefully Luke doesn't have to go for a slide. Whew. So far so good. For a final episode, so far not much bad has happened. But I shouldn't speak so soon, because something bad's gonna happen. Are you sure that's the best place to put a fire around some voltages? Oh, Arvo. Today's my birthday. Here as I can tell, at least. Huh. Definitely this week. Well, happy birthday, Luke. Yeah, man. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, man. So, how old are you now? I am 27 years old. That's pretty old. <laughs> Sweet. Sure as hell feel a lot older. Don't even start with that shit. Got out of college five years ago. Feels like a million years. Yeah. At least I don't have to worry about paying off them student loans. I hear that. I'm sure that's some <laughs> asshole sitting on the yeah. to work waiting to come Student collect. loans. Pain in Probably. the ass shit. Zombie apocalypse, please I'd happen. I'd like to go to college. I hope I can go someday. Maybe when this is all over. That'd be nice. I hope so too, Clem. I don't know. Just a waste of money. Well, the major in art history hasn't helped too much the last few years. Sounds like you majored in working in a coffee shop. Pretty much. Oh, stop. Yeah. That's pretty much uh, college in general. Keep the old man happy. Oh, I almost forgot. We're saving it for a special occasion, and all it being your birthday and all, figure this is as good a time as any. Where did you get it? Bill kept all the alcohol in the armory. He didn't like people imbibing. What's All right. that mean? Drinking. He, he didn't think people should drink. 
Okay, I guess that's one possibility. Feel a little guilty taking Carver. the first. Whoa, uh, wait! You gotta make a toast. I'm not really the. Uh, Come on, birthday boy. It don't have to be fancy. Come a on, birthday boy. Means we all got something to drink. Oh, we can just pass the bottle around afterwards. Go on. <clears throat> Rum. Okay. To the loved ones that we've lost along the way, and to the hope that we see them again, someday. Here, here. That was real nice. Yeah. I didn't mean for it to rhyme. That was... Well, I got first watch. I think the fence has got us pretty secure. We can't be too careful. The baby might be cold. Nah, I'll keep him warm. He's a tough little guy. Come on, Kenny. At least have a drink. Nah, maybe later. Clem, good, let him go. good, Kenny. I'm gonna yeah, post he's up taking responsibility. Here the That's there. good. Holler if you need anything. Thanks, Kenny. You're like, come and have a drink. Okay. I guess we Fire's have an option to nice. take a drink or nice. Plenty of room if you want to get warm. Not. Maybe in a bit. I didn't expect her to come back. Just when I thought I got her figured out, she up and surprises. It's a good thing. You saved our ass. I know. I know. I just don't know what she's getting at all this. We're lucky to have her. I'm glad she's here. Hell yeah. Well, she helped us back there. So that puts her as okay in my book. Well, it ain't no secret how you feel about it. Mm -hmm. Oh, come on. I'm just teasing. It was stupid. I understand. She's a pretty girl. Once you get past all the dirt and guts. Yep. I don't know. I guess I just wanted to forget about all this shit for like ten minutes. Ten minutes? Man, that's longer than I'd last at this point. Hey. <laughs> all right. Nice. Yeah, it wasn't ten minutes. Come on. We got a little one around. Sorry. Forget I said anything. I know what you guys are talking about. I certainly hope not. You're talking about kissing stuff. Uh, yeah. Yes. Yes. That, that is exactly <laughs> Was there any kissing? You shut your mouth right now. The both of you. <laughs> oh, man. Poor Clam. She doesn't know. But we know. We know what it was. It was a nice little... Huh. Maybe she came back huh. for you. Huh. Could be. Huh. I don't huh. know what to say to that. I don't know. Maybe she likes him? No, I think we could bet on that. Because you see here... Oh, Luke, do it deep! Luke's huh. a regular casino. Hey, shut up. Don't be modest. Your moves are working on all the ladies. Oh, fuck yeah, oh, Luke! Oh, oh, Luke! Do it to oh, me! Do it to me! I just did it Come too, didn't I? Ah. Sorry. It's Sorry, guys. Talking. I just couldn't resist. A drunk man's talk is a sober man's thoughts. Well, I ain't a man, so they can take that shit somewhere else. Clem, go see if you can get Jane and Kenny over by the fire. It's too cold for them to be out there like that. Oh, and here, maybe a swig of this will change their minds. All right. So I guess we don't have an option to drink the bottle. Okay. Um, Arvo, Transformer. Eh, let's see what the Transformer's doing. Uh, I'll talk to Kenny Miss first. TV. Feels like forever since we had electricity. Well, you did have electricity when you were at Carver, so yeah. Uh, Kenny, you want a drink? Hey, you know what? Maybe it's best for him not to drink. There, there, little guy. Shh. Shh, I got you. I got you. Hey. Oh, hey, Clem. You didn't notice me holding Just, the bottle? Uh, needed some air. Kenny, there's air everywhere. <laughs> uh, nice reply, Clem. I'm sorry. For, for how I acted back there after Sarita was I just I, I couldn't handle it I'm sorry I mean you did what you could you tried to help 
and I blamed you for it. I'm so, so sorry. You don't have anything to apologize for. I know you didn't mean it. Thanks. <laughs> yeah. I miss my boy. I miss him so much. I didn't raise him like I should have. Made mistakes. Wasn't there a whole lot for a couple years. Off on a boat somewhere or other. Well, maybe AJ is your chance for redemption. I thought I enjoyed that time away from him. From my family. But I'd give anything for one more second with them. To play catch with Doug. To touch Katja's face. Anything in the world. Maybe you'll see them again someday. Well, from here on out, I'm gonna try and believe that too. Okay, my arm's all red now. Damn. It's gonna be different with him. He's gonna get raised right. I won't make the same mistakes again. That's a promise. Mm-hmm. You should get back over by the fire. Ain't no sense in both of us being over here. I can handle watch on my own. The baby might be cold. Maybe you should bring him by the fire. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Yeah, I... I did that for the baby. I mean, Kenny does deserve alone time, but the baby needs to be warm. Last thing we need is a sick baby. Fire. Can't talk to any of these people. Um, uh, before I go to Jane, I'm going to go over to... Uh, I'm going to talk to Arvo, just see how he's doing. I've lost people too. We all have. Leave me alone, please. Can I say more to him? What? Are you serious? I want to at least apologize as well. I just thought the first that you know, I never mind. I'm sorry, Arvo. I didn't. At least we don't need to worry about being electrocuted. Unless somebody turns it on at the last minute and then all of a sudden Arvo dies. Okay. Jane, you want a bottle? There you go, Jenny. They expect you to lure me over there with alcohol? I wouldn't have expected a bottle to last this long. It's probably been a while for everyone. We just want you to feel welcome. It's warm over by the fire. <laughs> what is it? It's rum. Eh, what the heck. She feels for I don't him. Know. I don't know. It might be awkward. I wasn't expecting to... You know. Why? Because you made it with Luke? <laughs> what does that even mean? What's the it? You know. Yeah, because I made it with Luke. Mm -hmm. It's not a big deal. Why does this feel like I'm signing a contract or something? <laughs> really like the start of this episode. I mean... That's really good. Have you had any? Want to sip? It's okay. It just might burn a little. You'll feel it in your nose. Um... Sure. Never had rum before. <laughs> you okay? It's not as bad as the moonshine stuff I had with Nick. Whoa. Yeah, that stuff was like fire. <laughs> I've had a little bit of whiskey one time. Yeah, it has a burning sensation. Uh oh, busted. I better take that back. Ar Ar I wasn't too much older than you when I had my first drink. God, I was so stupid back then. There was this time I broke into my parents' liquor cabinet and drank a whole bottle of this really spicy, sweet liquor. Oh, what was its name? Oh, it was dumb. Earthquake or something. Sounds like you were a bad kid. Yeah. I guess I was. Yeah, what the heck? At the She's good. At the bottle, there were these sugar crystals, and I got it in my head that I really wanted to eat a couple. So I got the bright idea to smash it on my parents' dining room floor to get at them. And it shattered into a thousand pieces. 
Did you ever get caught? <laughs> yeah. I like the conversations we're glasses, having. It looks a lot like sugar crystals. That's never really been a problem for me. Keep it that way. My sister found me, drunk, blood pouring out of my mouth. Jamie Eek. thought I was dying, so she called 911. They pumped my stomach. Holy shit. <laughs> you swore, Clam. I haven't thought about that in a long time. So far, so good. Really good. I, I love the connection these I characters are having. guess a deal. Here. Guess I'll give it back to the group. Come on, you two. Go and kiss. Weird. Awesome. Awesome. We convinced Jane to go back with the group. Great. Awesome. Clementine. Putting Wanna the group together. Here? Awesome. No. That's... I'm fine. Oh, yeah. Okay. Wherever you like. You can sit beside Luke. Come on. It's his birthday. Share a kiss. Mwah. Share a kiss. Maybe put your hand on his dick and just stroke it a little. Okay, I'll shut up. Um, Arvo, can I talk to you? No, looks like we still can't <laughs> talk to Arvo. Jane, you don't have to justify that with a response. Hey. I find it's best to just get this stuff out in the open. Less drama. Well, that's fine. But I can confirm there was no time for kissing. Just do it. All right, enough of that. Hey, you, Clem. It's nice to hear people laughing. Yeah, it is. You just Hell yeah. spend so much time trying to stay alive that you don't get a chance to enjoy living. Yeah. We need to make more time for that. Alcohol helps. <laughs> Hell yeah, it does. <laughs> yeah, well, don't get addicted to it. It's bad to get addicted to drugs in the apocalypse. Let me get that bottle. We got someone else that might need some help. Sounds like a waste of good rum. He lost his sister today. And whose fault was that? That makes it even harder to deal with. Trust me. Kenny, please, don't let it ruin a nice night. I said my piece. Hey, come on, just get, just, come on. I don't think that boy's a bad person. I just think good people do bad things sometimes. Like we all have. A lot more nowadays with the world being what it is. So, I think it's best Leave to... Leave me alone! Sorry, okay? My fault. I shouldn't have- Leave me alone! Arvo, come on. Please, Steve. It's okay. It's okay. She's in a better place. It's okay. It's okay. Starting to like Maybe Mike more. It's best if we all get some rest. Who knows how long a walk we got tomorrow? I feel so sorry yeah. for Arvo. That's a good idea. I'll take first watch. Thank you, Kenny. Really? I, uh. Don't mention it. And he's still yeah, holding good. the baby. It was nice while it lasted. But you know what? If anybody's gonna be a parent to, um, AJ. It should be Kenny. I mean, uh, yes, Kenny is out of control, but he deserves to at least have the, um, he, he deserves to at least raise a child again, have a second chance, uh, a chance that he never really got with uh, Duck after Duck died, because Duck was never really adapted into this uh, kind of world like Clementine was. And that's why you when sure I was... You're good. Yeah, 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 I'm good. If I, if I start to crap out, I'll let you know. Okay, will you do that? It's no trouble. How right. much further? Close. Very close. You've been saying that every time I ask. Please. Come. I'm really starting to think <gasps> you're full of shit. Look out! There's a walker! What the fuck? Ah, ah, ah! Oh no. 
Jesus oh. Christ. Where's the baby? That was close. Fucker came out of nowhere. That was real loud. Hopefully there aren't more of them. Yeah, well, let's move. We don't want to be around to find out. It's very close. Come. Oh, man. AJ, just calm down. Just know we're, si we're protecting you. That's what your mother would want for yeah. you. That piece of shit? It's half built. We're here for the supplies, not the house. It's warm. Fireplace. Very warm. I'd just like a place to sit, if I'm honest. Is there any other way to get there? Do we have to cross the lake? I should have stuck to the tree line. The fastest way between two things is a straight line. It's not far. Just be on the lookout. Okay, uh... Oh, this Maybe is skeptical. Maybe there's a way around. I don't see any. Say it in an American asshole. It's okay. Yes. Walk. Ice. No shit ice. That's the problem. He's saying it's fine. I go first. I can be front. If we just go real slow, it'll probably be okay. Yeah, no need to rush this. We need to spread out. Oh no. Just to be safe. Luke is not in any better. condition to do it. Let the Rusky go first, since he's so confident. It's okay. Maybe he might run at last minute. Luke, don't die. Whoever's holding the baby, don't slip. Whew. I've walked on a frozen lake before. It's not really scary considering the whole thing was covered in snow, and I guess it was solid ice. Whew. Well, so far so good. And if the walkers come, the walkers will go slipping. <laughs> That'd be funny. Oh no. We're okay. Don't worry. Luke, don't die. We got some walkers behind us. That's only a few of them. Should be alright. Let's just get to the house. Come on, the walkers should be hey, slipping. Stay with us. Fuck. Oh no. That's two less to deal with. Just stay spread out and we'll be fine. Hey! Motherfucker! Shit! He's gonna kill him! Uh, Kenny! Get back here! No, you don't piece run! Of shit. Don't run with uh, the baby! Should let you drown, you piece of shit! No! Kenny! Don't hurt him! Okay, at least the baby's across. Well, they made it. Let's hope Luke makes it across. Where is Luke? Oh no, Luke, don't... D no. Luke, you're gonna make it. You're gonna fucking make don't it. Don't come over here. Hey, I can make it. It's, it's fine. You sure? Yeah. It's gonna be damn cold. You got walkers on the way. Let me help you. It's too you. thin for both of us. I just... Just gotta be careful. Oh, Luke, no. no! Stop! Stop! I'm fine! I'm fine! No, you're not! I just gotta pull myself out! You need help, Luke! The ice is too thin! I got it! You need to help! No! Clem, go! Go help no, him! No, Clem, Clem, do not! Just go back for him! You're lied! You, you Stop can do telling it. her that! Clem, look at me! Pull out your gun and shoot those damn walkers, okay? Just give me a little time. Clem, you can make it, but you need to go. No. Now. Clem, it's too dangerous. He's gonna yeah, die, I just need Clem. some more time. You guys gotta hurry. Just fall through. I can figure I it out. Cover. Thanks. Thanks. I'll be on a sec. Just, just keep shooting. Okay, just don't die, Luke. You're not gonna make it. I just, I'm on my leg. Okay, just, I just hold need on. A, I got you. Rest a sec. Uh, keep him off us, Clem. No, no, good. It's too much. Too Shut much. I got you. All right, good. No! Luke! Mm -hmm. 
Luke, you're gonna... Clementine, stop! Nothing more you can do! I'm gonna save him, shut up! Oh my god. No, Luke, no! No! I got you. I got you. Come on. Come on. Come on. You're gonna be okay. Go. Oh, thank God, Bunny's alive. Oh, thank God, Bunny's alive. Freeze to death. Luke, no. Fuck. Now that the only survivor from the cabin aside from me is Alvin Jr. Shit. Rest in peace, Luke. I should have tried to save Luke. There's a fireplace. Damn it. Jesus Christ. I thought covering for him would be the better we idea because I may not have gone him out in time. I may not have gone him out in time. He's just gone. Luke's fucking gone. We should have gone around. God damn it. We should have just fucking gone around. God damn it. It's my fault. I, sh I should have stayed with him. I said I started to go. There wasn't nothing any of us could do. Oh my god. You could have. You could have helped him. Don't listen to her, Clem. This ain't on you. Uh. Well, Bonnie, you don't rub it in. Bitch. This is your fucking fault! Kenny! Don't, man! Don't what? It's nobody's damn fault! It wasn't Arvo's fault. Luke was shot. And who got him shot? Look at this place. I Just shot a him? stack of fucking toothpicks. Bet those magical supplies are bullshit too. What? No speaking of English? Oh my Fuck god. You. you fucking commie piece of shit. Yeah, Kenny. Fuck you. <laughs> you mother. <laughs> what the <laughs> fuck, Kenny? <laughs> oh! Oh, well, make me this will make you realize how far you've gone. I think yelling at him was not going to help. If he physically hurt me in the process, especially in my condition, it probably would have saved Arvo. What? And what it worked. Your taste for this sort of thing? Shut up, Kenny. What did you do to him? There's another just like it. He wasn't lying. Thank God I saved Arvo while getting myself hurt in the process. You want to tell me how a can of fucking chili is going to help How is beating a kid to death going to help anyone? This is your fault, and you damn well know it. Can you just chill the fuck out? Just look at the baby if that calms you down. Fine. Mike, help me get a fire started. You okay? He's hurt real bad. Mike! Yeah. Yeah, okay. Rest in peace, Luke. You got a light? God. I never expected Luke I to die. I thought I had matches. And what a way for him to go out. Just wow. I think he had it worse than everyone else. You kept it. <laughs> Hell yeah, I did. Bonnie, you gonna warm up? Okay, I guess she's fine staying further away from the fire. Damn. Now I have a cut on my nose. God damn it. Alright. Oh my god, focus. Thank you. I wasn't sure how long it stopped recording. I wasn't looking. Jesus. He could have killed you. What the fuck is wrong with him? You're up. Hello. 
Kenny's out back trying to get some stupid truck started. Well, if it works, then why not? Here, you should eat something. You okay? Thank you. I can't believe he's gone. I've lost people before, but it just hasn't felt this, this shitty in a while. He cared about you too, Jane. I know he did. God damn it. Uh. I shouldn't have come back. It's I not your fault. I knew it. Always does. Well, I'm glad you did. I'm gonna find something to clean that up. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. So Mike I can't and this shit anymore. So at least Mike and I are defending Arvo. Feeling better? Yeah. Hell of a day. But we gotta get moving. If you're feeling up to it, I could use a hand out back with this truck. This house ain't worth a crap, but the vehicles ain't in bad shape. With a little luck, we can get one fixed up. Be out of here by nightfall. Just give me a minute. And I'll be out in a sec. I'll wait for you out back. All right, at least he agreed to that, and he didn't fight against that. Hey, Alvin. All right, you look over to Alvin. So Luke is gone. We still got Bonnie. We still got Mike. Still got Arvo, Kenny, and Jane. Clem. Rest in peace, Luke. Just... Just be careful. I always am. Sorry, Jane. And sorry, Arvo. Lost so many people, it's unfair. Alright, guys. So, that'll be the end of the second part of Episode 5 of The Walking Dead Season 2. So, fuck. Um... I really like how this episode is taking itself slow. It's not being over the top like episode 3 or um, kind of uh, dramatic and kind of depressing as episode 4. Instead, it's taking it more maturely and all that. And um, yeah, it's doing it. It's it's doing everything very well. Fuck Luke. Reckon, rest in peace, man. We'll miss you so much. Happy birthday. That's all I can say is happy birthday, man. So he died at the age of 27. Rest in peace, Luke. So now the only survivor from the cabin is Alvin Jr. And, of course, he Alvin Jr. wasn't even in the cabin. He was still uh, inside of Rebecca. So, yeah. Wow. I, can't, I, I find it hard to believe that everybody from the cabin died. If there was a way to save Luke, I hope there was... But if not, then rest in peace, Luke. We're going to miss you. So anyway, um, thank you guys so much for watching. So we still have um, Kenny, Jane, Bonnie, Mike, and Arvo. So yeah, so far so good. So thank you guys so much for watching. Oh, and Alvin Jr. So thank you guys so much for watching. And I'll see you guys in the next and hopefully final part of The Walking Dead Season 2, Episode 5. Goodbye.